Welcome. In this video, we're going to take a look at the uh, maximum purchase price calculator, your best offer. Now, this is the shorter version of our calculator, but it gives you a quick way to analyze a property to see what your best offer might be. So let's go ahead and dig into this. Uh, we'll put in the after repair value of the property. Let's say in this particular case, it's a, a $200,000 property. And we know that the repairs on this property is probably going to be about $40,000. That's our approximation. We want to make about 20% profit on this particular property when we purchase, or if we decide to flip it to sell it. And I'll leave that at 20%, which gives us a $40,000 profit. And our projected self cost would be if, let's say, we want to flip this property. We have about probably between 5 or 6% in cost for the realtor to be able to sell the property. And then you have another uh, another 4% buffer there of holding costs, depending on how many months it will take to uh, repair the property. You know, like in other words, uh, you're gonna have probably a mortgage, so you might be paying uh, a mortgage payment, uh, taxes, insurance, I maybe mean, need to turn on the water, the utilities and so on for those two, three months that you're rehabbing the property. Uh, I'm going to leave the cost here maybe, let's say, at about, uh, instead of 10%, let's go maybe about 8%. And also, if you're a wholesaler, if you click on the wholesale fee, let's say on this property, my wholesale fee will be $5,000. What the quick calculator will do is say, okay, you as a wholesaler, you need to purchase this property at $99,000. But for the investor that you're going to sell it to, their maximum purchase price has to be about 104000 for this property to make sense. In the next videos, we will take a look at the actual full maximum purchase price calculator. And thank you.